everyone, my name is Yanni, and I just want to quickly share something with you before we hand over to, to Bo and Connie, and we're going to join them in their home, and I'm sure there's going to be a powerful word released over all of us. So, But while we were worshiping this morning, while we prepared together as a team, there's just something that the Lord laid upon my heart. I want to share that with you. And that has got to do with the peace, the shalom of Jesus. Now, when Jesus sent out his disciples, he literally told them to go into a house and let their peace rest upon that home. Let their shalom rest upon that home. Now, I just want to quickly share something about the shalom of Jesus. Now, first of all, the peace and the shalom of the Lord is always connected with his presence, always. So when we say peace be upon you, we are literally saying may the presence of Jesus be upon you. It's connected with the presence of God always. Then something powerful, and I didn't know that. I found it out this morning also. Uh, the Jewish people, they know this well. But shalom for them, it describes the realm where chaos is not allowed to enter. I want to say that again. It describes the realm where chaos is not allowed to enter. That is where literally it says chaos being understood as sickness, war, social strife, or violence. And peace means that is the realm where chaos is not around to enter because it is the realm of the kingdom of heaven. It's the realm of Jesus. It is literally heaven on earth. So I want to declare right now, because Jesus said when we enter someone's house, we must declare the peace of God upon that house. We must declare shalom. Now, if you're listening to this, you have allowed us to be in your home. You have allowed us to worship with you and to acknowledge that Jesus is king. And I just want to declare the peace of God upon your house, the shalom of Jesus, where chaos is not allowed to enter and where the presence of Jesus is always connected with shalom. And I want to say this also. Uh, in the Hebrew word, the Hebrew word shalom, it's got a couple of meanings also. It means it's the notions of totality or completeness. So may completeness be upon your house right now. It means success. So I want to declare success all over your house right now. It means fulfillment. Full, oh, sorry, fulfillment. So may every prophetic word, and every promise be fulfilled over your home and over your house. It means harmony. I mean, harmony, I mean, that is just glorious. It means security and peace. It means well-being. So I want to declare that all over you right now. So if you are a man and a woman of faith, receive this right now. It's the peace. It's just the shalom of Jesus that he wants to release all over your house. In Jesus' name, I declare that. So 